Hello to all you lovely human beings and welcome to a brand new Cursed Outspawn PK series. Now, I started this series way back in February of 2022 and I've been working on it in secret for almost two years. This account is my journey of merching only via the TP, which is Spawn PK's Grand Exchange, starting with nothing but 100 million GP, or one bag as it's referred to in Spawn PK. I hope you all enjoyed this new series. A lot of work has gone into it. All right, folks, you know what time it is. Time to only use the TP. Woo, yeah, woo. Okay, we sold 25 of our AGSs right here. All of our rings are bigger because they are consistently good money. Very nice. These still have not sold. Going to renew them. Sold 20 of our averages. That's kind of nice. Uh, what else? We sold all of our promo packages. How much did we get these for? Let's see. Uh, your history promo package. Where are you, promos? There we go. That's one for two trill. I guess that was the last one we bought, but look at that. A trill profit each on these, I think. So that's super fucking nice. Look at that. Boom. Three trill in profit, another four trill in profit, and we sold them all out of sword for like 400 bill in profit. This thing still isn't selling, which is annoying the shit out of me, but it's fine. It's really going up and down. I'm going to put it back in for 124k. I just want it gone at this point. I'm done. I'm done dealing with this thing. So hopefully we can sell that soon. And shit, I mean, these promos have been selling for such good money. I'm just going to buy these two out. That'll be 1.6 trillion profit once we get there. Put these back in for 29.50. Oh, that's not, that's way too much. 29.500. There we go. So that'll be a, a decent chunk of profit there. Very nice. Going to buy out some Dragon Hunter crossbows as well for 150 billion, which is my max there. And we'll put them back in. Uh, this is going to be a passive merch here because it just takes one person who's like really desperate to get the enchant done. And so we'll just keep those in there for whenever they want it. Find some more Rings of Vigor out up until 50 bill, I think. Yep. And we also bought some before. I logged on, uh, I don't know how many days ago now, but a while ago. And uh, so yeah, there we go. We now have 27 Rings of Vigor. And we'll put them back in for 57 bill each. That'll be a nice chunky profit of like, I don't know, at least 200 bill. Also a grand promo here for 123k bags. Gonna put it back in for 130 and it will sell. So that'll be a nice 700 bill profit right there. Negotiated for the Swift Bow T at 3.1 trill. Gonna put it back in for four. Nice. All right, there we go. That's gonna be a nice 900 bill profit there. We have more cash, but nothing to spend it on. I think this is where we're leaving it for the week. We'll come back soon. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, so we sold four, six AGSs, seven rings of vigor. We bought a bunch more on the TP while those were selling. We sold the Accursed Scepter and the Grand Promo. Very, very nice. We have 384k packs here. I bought a bunch more promo packages. If we look in the history here, all for like 2 to 2.2 .2 trill each in the hopes that someone will buy it up for more because usually someone does eventually. Some gambler comes along and wants it. So we'll keep those in there. Uh, the Swift Bow still is not sold despite having bought it for pretty cheap. Let's see what the price is at now. 37.9. What do I have it at? 37.850? Yeah, 860. Great. Vigors have gone way, way up. Uh, I'll put these in for 700 each for now. Um, they'll go back down. They always do. But hey, when these sell, it'll be a nice chunky profit. I got 50 bill each. That'll be a nice, what, 660 bill profit. I'm going to keep slowly investing in averages. I know it seems crazy that they're not selling and I'm still buying more. Uh, eventually, I swear to God, someone will buy these because they do, they're, 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 they're important for the, uh, the collection log. That's why people buy them, right? So if I just buy all these out, eventually, eventually i know it's a it's a it's a crazy sounding idea they will sell although my profit on them isn't big enough that i should really be doing this over and over again but you know whatever sunken cost fallacy a little bit just bought some ags out of the tp for uh what was it two bags each i'm gonna put all these back in actually for not bags but i'm gonna put them in for 395 mil i know that seems silly but people will buy that over the one that's, you know, four bags, despite it being only like a 4.5 bill difference for all of these. Really nice cheap blood amulet of fury here. This thing sells for like 670 bills. That'll be a nice 270 bill profit. I don't know why somebody would sell these days cheap, but great. This is a silly little merch here. We're buying a cursed fang for 17 trill in cash, and we're gonna put it back in for 179k bags. It's gonna be around a trill profit. It's not bad, it's not amazing, but it's something. When we fill the TP, we have 186k bags left in here, but it's hard to find stuff right now. There's a lot of people, you know, being very tight with their margins. Hello, hello, hello. Here we are only using the TP, of course, as we do in our little later hose now pit. And let's see what we have sold in the TP today. 33 Rings of Vigor, which is nice. I did log in and buy more of those later on. 17 Dragon Hunter crossbows for 34.50 each. That's like, what, one, that's a 200 bill profit each. It's like a 3.4 trill profit right there, which is absolutely beautiful. Our Swift Bow T sold, that's gonna be 400 bill in profit. And the Curse Fang sold for 900 bill in profit. 304K bags here, as well as all these Vigors and stuff. 
And we also have these uh, promo packages here. Um, I'm tempted to buy more. Oh, no, 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 we're fine. Um, but yeah, these will sell, I think, eventually. I'm really deep into them, so I'm very hopeful. I'm gonna restock on a couple of these real quick. I mean, it's not gonna be huge, but you know, there's some a, a lot sold for 70 bill each, which is great. So I'm gonna put these all back in for 70 bill each, 63 to 70 bill. That's like a 1.2 trill profit. I'm gonna go deeper in on the Blood Amulet Security. Gonna buy four more of these. Um, it's gonna be a hundred something bill profit on each. I know it seems silly. I have so many that haven't sold already, right? But these really do, like, kind of like the Vigors do and the Dragon Hunter Crossbows do eventually. They will sell. Okay, so one of these sold a couple days ago for 22 trill. So I'm just gonna buy this for 20 trill, put it back in for 22 trill, and that'll be a nice two trillion GPM profit. Hopefully it sells. Hopefully no event comes around and makes these come back again and makes them low in price. Uh, so we'll see what happens. This is an amazing profit, but it's fine. Uh, gonna buy all these out for, let's say, up to there, yeah. Put it back in for 400 bill each. It's like, what, 100 bill in profit? No, it's, it's more than that. It's like 150 bill in profit. Not bad. So it's, it's a low stakes, but like, will sell eventually kind of thing. Buying more avarices, because someone else is gonna buy them too. Do, 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 do. Boom, boom. Okay, cool. We're gonna sell this all for 100 bill each one day. I promise it'll happen. Fan fucking fantastic what is that gonna be 85 of those bad boys you know i'm tempted to put them in for even more you know because this is such a long-term merch i'm doing here on these like i might as well just fucking go all out on them you know like why why am i am i settling for something as low as 100 billion as only you know 10 bill profit each for what was that a trillion gp in profit it's like nothing it's not nothing obviously right but it's still it's 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 less than what we can do with this many both we can really shake things up in the avarice space I'm realizing, no, we can't. We can't shake things up in the average space. Yikes. Let's sell them for 974. All right, I'm putting them for 973, bitch. How do you feel about that, huh? Yeah, we're fighting you and me. Okay, let's be real here for a moment. I'm back on only use DP. What's up? Unfortunately, I still have faith, you know. These have not sold. It's been quite a while. Frosty Tebow also hasn't sold. I lowered these just now. We sold eight of our mini me's, which ain't bad. We sold no AGSs, we'll put those back in, no Rings of Vigor, no Amy the Dams, but all the Avarices, which is super nice, over a trillion GP in profit right there with those alone. The Mystery Tickets all sold, that's like, I don't remember, that's like 200 bill profit or something like that. But these sold for like 1.7 trillion profit, which is so nice. We're 242k bags and all the stuff in here. I think this will all sell in time, it's just a matter of when. In the meantime, I will go back to buying Avarices for 90 bill each. I will just put those in the bank for now. Just kidding, why would we do that? Back in for 1100 bags each, it'll be 180 bill in profit later. And look at these bad boys, right back at it again, very nice. I'm gonna put them back in for 8400, because I think Skatiza Farm's got the right idea here. If we go here, here, put five of them in for 8400, that's a huge profit. That's like 1.5 trillion of those sell for that price, which they probably won't, but hey, you never know. I'm gonna do a bit of a weird one. Um, Inquisitor legs. I know it's weird to buy these for like 545, 55, 75, right? The next one up from there is 800, and when Wandering Merchant comes around, these things sometimes sell for a trill each. So I'm gonna put them in for a trill each. If I sell one of them, I've made back half my money already. So that'd be great once those sell, and I think they will. Not 100% on these, because again, it's a bit of a risk, but I like taking the risks. So Grand Promos have been selling for like 17.5 lately for some reason so i'm gonna buy this one for 148 put it back in for 175k and I, I think it'll sell you know and that'll be three troll profit when it does i'm back something amazing has happened here today finally it is done it is complete we sold one mini me for 13.95 bags sold none of these but we sold 17 promo package threes baby look at this oh my Fucking God, that is like 10 trail plus in profit. Let's collect that shit right now. Beautiful, 485k bags. We also a Frosty Tebow, like a trail profit there. 699k in bags, baby. We gotta sell all this other stuff too, but that is just goddamn beautiful. I'm uh, gonna buy some grand promos out because that's what you do when you have a lot of money. It's an easy merch. We'll buy one more here, nice. And I'm gonna put it back in for 17 trail each. So in theory, if these were to all sell, that would be Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen trillion profit. So we'll put these in here with this one, and we'll make a new one here for these three. Wish me luck, because this would be just a huge payoff. And again, worst comes to worst, to make a trillion each. It's not bad. Hello, hello, hello. Back on only use TP. We got a problem here. So these two sold, which is great, but nothing else sold. It's been like three to four weeks since the last clip, I think. But we're gonna take all these out. 
Uh, the Avarice is sold for 20 bill profit. Eat great. So I know I can sell them for 110. So I am going to just spend all the money here uh, on Avarices, because why not, right? It's a, it's a pretty consistent profit maker. Nice. And we'll put all these back in for 1100 each. The problem is that the Grand Promos are not selling. They will, but they're not currently selling.